AI art generators bring a huge revaluation in the graphic industry. Stable Diffusion played a key role in this entire revaluation. Still, now they are working behind to improve this industry. Recently, they launched their latest model, Stable Diffusion 3, or SD3. It's obviously good news for all designers, but there is bad news also. You can't use SD3 models in Civitai or Stability App because they banned SD3. Don't worry, you can still use SD3, even if you don't have a GPU on your system. Today, I will introduce an AI image generator, which allows you to generate images with SD3 models. And it's more than an image generator. So, without further ado, let's dive in. Introducing Shaker AI, a powerful AI image generator and premium image generator models hub. You can create any kind of image with this amazing platform. It has a vast library of premium quality checkpoint and LoRa models for different use cases such as photography, illustration, anime and games, realistic, fantasy, 3D, and many more. You can select a model and generate images with them. So, let's start our image generation journey with Shaker AI. I will put the link in the description. Just head over there and then create an account. Once you are successfully logged in, your interface will be like this. Now you can access the Shaker AI image generator in two ways. Simply click on this AI generator button. Another method is selecting a model and then generating images with this particular model. As I told you at the start of the video, Shaker AI supports SD3 models, so I will start with model. Here you will find unlimited models. So to find the perfect one, we can use the filter. First of all, the model type. I will select only the checkpoint model. We can select the LoRa model later. After that, the base model. For example, I want to use only the model based on the new SD3 model. On the bottom, you will find the model application scope and commercial license. If you select generated image is commercially usable from here, then you will get the commercial license of your generated image. Once the filters are set, you will find the models you want. Now choose one of them. I will go with this one. Now, if you want to use this model on your system, then you can download it from here. And to use it on Shaker AI, click on the run model from here. All right, this is the Shaker AI image generator platform. Here you can see some of my previous generation. On the left side of the page, you will find some example images. Now to generate images, you have to enter our prompt on this prompt box. This time, I am entering a prompt generated by ChatGPT. If you are not so good at prompt, there are options to enhance prompt and autofill also. Under the prompt box, you will find the negative prompt option. That means what you don't want to your image. Again, I am entering prompts from ChatGPT. Next, the base model checkpoint. Here you can see our selected checkpoint model. You can change it from here. Okay, after selecting the base model, to add a LoRa model, click here. There is a vast library of LoRa models you can choose as per your need. Shaker AI supports using multiple LoRa, which can provide more customized results. Next, the image reference option. If you want to generate a new image with any image reference, then you can add it from here. After that, the parameters settings. First of all, the sampler methods, and then you will find the sampling steps. We have a default 20, but if we want more, we can go ahead and add in more. Next, the seed. If you want to use a fixed set to generate consistent images, you can enter the seeds here. After that, if you are generating a portrait image or image of any person, then this option is very important for you. You will find the option to fix hand and face from here. This time I don't need it. Okay, next, the size setting. Set the image size you need. In the end, you will find the number of images. You can generate a maximum of four images at a time. Of course, more images will use more credits. All right, after everything is set, hit the generate button. Now we need to wait some time. And here it is, our images have been generated. Shaker AI generates four beautiful unicorns on futuristic city road images, according to my prompt. And honestly, the image quality is top notch. I will make it full screen to show the quality. Before that, Let's have a look at some other interesting features of Shaker AI. Here under every image, you will find some options. First, the vary, stable. 
If you want to generate a variation of any particular image, click here. As you can see, it generates four variations of this particular image. After that, with this prompt button, you can reuse any image prompt. To find out the generated model, click on this model match button. The last option is the reference option. You can use any image as the reference image with this option. That's not the end. On the top of the page, some other incredible features. Let's explore them one by one. First of all, the in-paint option. With this tool, we can in-paint any part of our image. For example, in this image, you can see a girl, but wants a boy in her place. So what do I need to do? Select the image and then click on the in-paint option from here. Now it will analyze the image. Once it is complete, you can select the elements from the image with the Auto Selector tool. There are LISO and Rectangle Selector tools also available. Once the object is selected, enter your desired object description in the prompt box. After that, hit the Generate button. Shaker AI will generate four version. You can see the preview and add them to the canvas. OK, the next feature is the Upscale image. With this tool, you can upscale any image up to 4x. After selecting the image, click on the Upscale image. After coming here, set the Upscale value, Parameter Scale, and Style. Next, in the Advanced option, set the details, HDR, Similarity, and Prompt value, and then hit the Generate button. And here it is, the upscaled image is ready. Our next option is Remove Background. If you want to remove any image background, simply select the image and then click on Remove Background from here and your image background will be removed instantly like this. Next, with this Remove tool, you can remove any object from the image. After selecting the image, select the area with the Lesso or Rectangle Selector tool and then hit the Remove button. After that, you can crop any image with this Crop tool. Next, the Outpaint tool. You can expand any image with this Outpaint tool. In the end, you will find the Collage tool. If you want to make a collage, first arrange the images according to your need. For example, I'm going to put that one here, and maybe I'll put that one here. The canvas of this platform is infinite. This amazing feature could be a game changer for comic storyboard designers also. In this method, arrange all the images, and then select all the images you want to use, and then hit the collage button from here. And here it is, your college is ready. All right. Now, if you want to download any image, simply just click on this little down arrow from here and our image is saved to our device. Now, if I open this image, you can see the quality of the image. And most importantly, there's no watermark. This is very important. Most AI image generators that allow you to try it out for free come with watermarks and some of them, I'm looking at you mid-journey. Don't even give you a free trial. They don't even let you try one without paying for it. Now the question is, is Shaker AI free to use? Yes, you can use it for free. It will provide you with 200 free credits per day. But if you are serious about Art Generator, then you can buy a subscription plan from here, which starts only from $8. You will also get unlimited access to member-exclusive models, which allows you to use generated pictures for commercial purposes. I will put the link in the description, where so many image generation models are waiting for you. That's our today's video. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.